Hello and welcome back to The Source. I'm Jack. And I'm Nat. And in this part of the show, we're talking to two very special agents down here on the waterfront. We have Will over here. Hi, how you doing? Good, thank you. And Alex. I'm Alex, hi. Now, you're from HQ Recon, which is a bit of a stealth game. You've got to be pretty smart to do this. So do you want to tell us a bit about it? Yeah, so essentially, it takes place in the city and in the woods. And okay. the idea is that our operatives have to get in and out of an area without being caught by a professional hunter team. Okay, so it's Hunt's a bit... team? That sounds professional scary. Professional hunters, that does, sound, that does sound scary. You just have to be a bit of a James Bond to do something like this, right? You need to be pretty smart, yeah. It, it's all about thinking, it's strategy. So in, instead of just running in, you have to stop and analyse the situation and work your way through it carefully. So HQ Recon is like, uh, it's an urban game then, so... It's a stealth sport. A stealth sport? <laughs> yeah, yeah. Okay. So yeah. You run it also from the, in the city and in the woods. You're saying it's all about strategy. What are some of the, give us some top tips, some of the best strategies to win this game? Well, the urban, the urban event is all about uh, looking like you're a member of the public and, and just slipping past unnoticed. Jack would lose that straight away. Yeah. <laughs> I, 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 wouldn't, I wouldn't, we've seen, I wouldn't uh, be great at that. We've seen some great strategies to do it. Uh, in our last event, a couple found this empty TV box and uh, between them they carried this huge TV box oh, wow. all the way through the middle of the zones and the hunters just left them alone because they just assumed that they were you know, doing some shopping. So it was quite a difficult <laughs> job for the hunters then, because what, yeah. what if they pounce on an unsuspecting member of the public? All our operatives have got little numbers on their backs, which uh, you need to be quite close to read, but, but you know, so our hunters know who's who so if they get it, close to you. So there's no going up to random strangers and like grabbing them and thinking <laughs> that they're in this game or anything like that? There's no physical contact. Oh, so oh okay. So once they see you, scary. when they see you, they'll uh, radio in oh, to uh, okay. so, our, and then our you, is it You lose points? Yeah, so you get points and uh, you, get, you, so you get points if you um, complete the zone. Okay. And then we have a statistics module on our website where you can then look at your career and, cool. and, and get better and get up the ranks. Nice. Wow. It's a whole career involved in it. So <laughs> the reason we've got you on the show, obviously, guys, is that you're running an event in Bristol this Saturday. We are, yeah. Saturday night. And it's only a couple of hours. Yep, 90 minutes. Um, and the Hatchet Inn, the, you know, Bristol's oldest pub, have um, been kind enough to give us a place um, to run our, run our event out of. So that'll be our HQ. And we'll be sending operatives out into, out into the city here. Uh, to, to slip past our hunters and get the job done. Fun. So how yeah. long does the game last then? What's the sort of...? Um, so each zone will take about 40 minutes and you've got 90 minutes in total to do the whole event and then it's back to the pub for a, for a good social and a run through of how everyone got on. Cool. Yeah. Good. Very cool. It's pretty good. So how can people get involved? Do they just come down and join in or do they put on a website or anything like that? Yes, yeah, so we have a website, hqrecon.com. Uh, we have Facebook presence, we're on meetup.com. Loads of ways to get involved, yeah. Oh, right. Is there an fun. age range? Like, is it sort of something that people can do with their kids? Because they'd be a good decoy. <laughs> no, you need, to be, you need to be 18 plus, unfortunately. Um, it's adrenaline. Yeah, <laughs> and, 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 it involves, um, and it involves running around the city um, after dark. So, okay, yeah. <laughs> so, so, yeah, you need to be 18 plus, but otherwise uh, anyone can do it, yeah. Okay, yeah. cool. And you've still got spaces for this Saturday as well? Yeah, yeah, we have. And it's, um, it really is open to anyone. You don't need to be fit. Um, there's enough time that you can do our event, um, you know, just walking. Yeah. Um, you might not win it, but then it's not about the winning. It's just about having the fun and getting a bit social. And, yeah. yeah. And uh, Alex, how much does it cost to join in? It's uh, well, depending on what time you buy it. So if you're yeah. quite early, there's an early bird, fifteen pounds, okay. and it goes up to twenty, twenty-five pounds. Wonderful! Great. Thank you very much. Enjoy. No worries. But now it's time to go over to the bird cage where Nat is catching up with Laura Doggett. <laughs> 